Hello YouTubers, it's James again here. Um, I made a video last night which one or two of you have seen now uh, concerning an update for my channel. Well I mentioned that I was using a radio microphone and I wasn't really happy with it. So what I've done, I've, uh, I've gone out and I found another one that I think might be better. I've tried adjusting the uh, sound levels on this one and it's not really very good. I'm not having much luck with it at all. So what I'm going to do is to show you the new one that I bought. I'm going to hopefully get it set up and working tonight and do another video next uh, and you'll hopefully see the difference in them, okay? So the camera I've bought, I got this, sorry, not camera, the microphone, sorry. I've got cameras on the brain. I am also in the process of getting a new camera. Uh, the problem being that the camera I'm using now is a webcam which is on the screen of the computer and it's not very good. So um, there's, there's quite a few things I'm changing around which uh, very, very soon you'll see the updates for. But the first thing that I want to show you now, if I just step back a bit, is this. Now this is a uh, ProSound VHF wireless microphone. Um, it comes in two different forms. It comes as a lapel microphone, uh, so you can uh, have a little clip on mic like I've got at the moment, um, which is the same as the one I'm using now, which is the little microphone pack there. Or it comes with a handheld uh, uh, microphone. Uh, I, I decided obviously that I wanted to go for this one. I don't want a microphone that's going to be obvious. I don't want to have um, a microphone in the hand or nearby the face. I like this one here. As you can see that, it's just a little mic that clips onto your t-shirt. It's out of the way, it's non-obtrusive. And I think that the sound sometimes is a little bit better on them. So that's what I wanted to stick to. I wanted to stick to this format. So I've gone out and I've been to Maplin's Electronics and I've purchased this one. Okay. So I'm going to show you the kit as I unbox it, so you can see what comes in the box. All right. There's various different types you can get. There's VHF and UHF. My understanding is that the UHF, which are the more expensive ones, are better quality sound. Uh, that's partially because of the frequency that they use. They're not quite so prone to interference like the uh, the VHF which I'm using at the moment. Um, but I didn't want to spend that sort of money just yet on the microphone. Um, I'm trying to keep the budget down as much as I can. But I want to improve on what I've got. So that's the purpose I've done this. Okay. So comes in a very good presentation box. And this is what we have. This is the inside. So first of all, let's start. All right. Okay, a Pro Sound VHF. That's the uh, the transmitter box there. The top where you plug the microphone. Uh, microphone plugs in there. LED and a little power switch there. Pretty much very very similar to what I'm using at the moment. Um, runs off one nine volt. PP3 battery, uh, various leads it comes with. Um, okay, so this is um, this is a microphone lead. As you can see, it comes with I don't know the size of these, sorry, but that's a big chunky one there that will plug into your uh, your electric um, keyboard or your electric guitar, and that in there obviously will plug into the microphone. Uh, and it screws into place as well, so it can't be pulled out accidentally. So, so that's obviously what that one's for. Um, this is the microphone that I want to be using. Right, that's quite a big one. Foam shield, which is good if you're outdoors, but indoors, not really necessary. But still, that's the microphone there. Uh, and it is quite, quite a bulky one. I think what I might do is to replace that or use my existing microphone. On that one, um, but that's that anyway. Right, okay. This looks to be like a Madonna headset. I call them Madonna headsets. I don't know what they're actually called. Um, I shan't be using this. I can't see where I would need to use this one. Um, if I was dancing around on stage, maybe. Uh, but now I can't see that being used. So I think that will just be staying in the box out of the way. Instructions. There we go. Instructions, that's what we only ever read when things don't work. Right now, for the receiver. How then? Unfortunately, 
for mobile or portable use not ideal because it's quite a big chunky receiver it's not the sort of thing you can just fasten on top of your camera uh, with a built-in battery uh, this is going to be something that you have to uh, plug into your mains uh, but it comes with a transformer there uh, mains transformer which is good and another lead here what is this one oh, okay two chubby ends on the lead this is clearly to uh, take if you have a look at the back um, clearly that can go into the audio out from there uh, and plug straight into an amplifier or using an adapter to uh, to shrink the plug down a bit uh, straight in my case straight into the back of the computer so that's what I'll do okay quite Gucci that looks all right um, looking at the front uh, you've got a microphone volume okay so a little microphone volume gain control there uh, LED display to show you which channels you're using uh, and on and off it's one of the most basic radios um, radio microphones that you can get I think I've done a bit of research on uh, on internet uh, especially on YouTube and um, this, this certainly is one of the cheaper ones but like I said I don't want to spend a lot of money at the moment it, it's just to get something better than what I have at the moment so that is that so it's just now a matter of connecting it all up and uh, I'm seeing how well it works um, this is very very similar to my existing the light is very poor in here I do, do apologize for that uh, the light, the uh, microphone uh, transmitter, this new one, is very, very similar to the existing one I'm using. You've got a, a separate volume control there. Can you see that? Where are we? You probably can't. It's too dark in the moment. Uh, but you can actually alter your microphone gain there. So that plugs into there. Nice and secure fitting. And then, presumably like so oh a bit of a crack that's where you can put your battery in they're never easy to open there we go that's good on it all right make sure it's turned off uh, just put the battery in the right way certainly help them so okay and there we go they're not too on just yet, it might interfere with my existing mic. Okay, so give me a few minutes, I'll get this connected up, and then uh, we'll have a play and see what it sounds like. So, thanks for watching, stay tuned, and I'll see you soon.